once again, I shall be doing the demo test play of Final Fantasy XI online. We're gonna make a new character again, once again. This time, the oh so beautiful and tempting Mifra. Yes. Do I want that hair? I don't know. I kinda like this hair. Oh my god, you guys see the newspapers? Apparently, motherfucking Tom Cruise is leaving Scientology for his daughter Suri. Holy crap. Like, my god. Like, how do you just how do you, how do you do that? How do you just leave the religion that you created? But serious though, it's serious news though. Um, Dallas. Uh, In serious news though, um, I finally completed. I finally was able to do my final presentation for college. My god, it was it was crazy. I did my final presentation on motherfucking um about conventions and talk about how like, you know, conventions are a fun place to be and you should go to conventions and you get to see cosplay, get to make friends, get to see unknown stuff walking through the hallways. And I didn't really practice at all. I like on the day of presentation I was at home and I was like finish I was like finishing a PowerPoint for it. And I basically just like ad libbed lines that I would say every time throughout the PowerPoint, but I didn't actually practice it. And my god, I wish I did because I was doing okay at the beginning, you know, I was stuttering a little and I was kind of nervous because, you know, it's like public speaking and you're like talking to the class and you gotta, you know, look people in the eyes and crap and stuff, but oh my god, it was, it got really bad because it got to the point where like my mouth dried up and I was like, <clears throat> and I was sitting there talking and I had to talk and I was, my mouth dried up like in the middle of it. You guys hear me talking for like, you know, 20 minutes at a time. Even doing like Let's Real Life videos. I talk for like long periods of times. Sometimes up to an hour's worth of time. With a, with a mask on. And by the way, that mask is really, that mask becomes really hard to breathe in. But, you know, I talk for that long. And it's really no problem. But talking for just like three, four minutes in front of the class was so gut-wrenching. It was like... I couldn't breathe. I was getting nervous. I was like, oh my god. My mouth's all dried up. My lips my, my lips are sticking together when I close them during talking. Oh shit. It was scary. It was very scary. But I got through it and everyone clapped and I got a bunch of questions asked about conventions. And it was, it was pretty cool. I found out that one of, the, one of my classmates in the class actually did go to Kineticon last year. And she's talking about going again this year, or 20, in 2013, so that was pretty cool. But, and, there, and there's another girl, the girl was talking about before who, cos, who went to cosplay as Zelda. She was talking to, she was like, she talked to me afterwards and stuff. She's all like, talking about how she wants to do Zelda still. Or possibly Link, be like a female Link. And she's like, I don't think many, co many girls cosplay as Link. I'm like, are you kidding me? <laughs> like, half the, co half the cosplayers who cosplay as Link at conventions are female. Like, even at Anime Boss in 2012, um, the Masquerade, there was a skit where there was, like, uh, Zelda and Link, and the Link in that skit was female, so, yeah. She should definitely cosplay, and I told her she should definitely, co and she was planning on making her own cosplay, too, so that's gonna be interesting if she actually does end up cosplaying. Alright, so that's how this other Mithra bitch, she's got cleavage showing. Oh, what did I just say? Oh, shit. I, I suspect lesbianism is going to happen. I hope it does. She seems pretty interested in me. Or maybe not. She's just talking about fucking shit. Stables, chocobo house, fucking mountains and crap. The church. I don't care about the church. Wait. 
I don't have that much gill. I don't even have any gill when you start off. Yeah. <gasps> what? Oh, uh, fucking tar tar people. Fuck them. Yeah. Son of a bitch. Jack. Does he have a chainsaw arm? Leviathan. Let's see how many people are in this world right now. It's it is now currently 150 2 o'clock p.m. on a Thursday. I should get my paycheck now, but I'm not going to. I don't feel like moving. 800 people! Wow, that's really low. Our window server already. Uh, and also, I noticed the music, the audio is still fucking loud. So, what I'm gonna have to do is, is like, make sure that the audio is not fucking loud from the. Am I, if for some reason my audio, my actual own audio is really, really weird sounding. Like, it sounds really, really. Crappy. I don't know why. I might get a new mic. I don't know. Ah <laughs> That should make it easier to sound to hear the sound of my voice being implanted into your brains. Ha <laughs> Alright, let's go. First of all, first of all, with, like with any female character you make, you have to take your clothes off first. That's like the that's like the rule of that's like the rule of MMOs. When you first start off, you just have to take your clothes off, and then once you actually start like you know get into the game, you have to put your clothes back on. But for now, we're gonna we're gonna we're gonna run around naked in our see-through panties. They look kind of see-through, sort of. I mean, yeah, they're kind they're kind of see-through. That's kind that's kind of neat, I guess. Oh, 50 gil. Now I have 50... 60 gil. Wow. I have a lot of cash. Wow. All right, man. That's a lot of money. I could buy so much with 50, 60 gil. Wait, where am I going? I don't even know where I'm at. I don't like windows. It's so confusing. All right, so... The kill stuff outside is over here. But yeah, though, finally... I finally did my final presentation speech for a public speaking class, and I'm happy it's done now. And it just sucked because I was, I was like so nervous and I just wanted it to be done and it's finally done. And then there's two more presentations, which wasn't bad, but then, you know, the teacher, did, and then the teacher's like, oh, we have to go over and view for the final exam. I'm like, God, can we just fucking leave? I'm so nervous. I'm just so agitated and annoyed and just like, just, ugh. I'm doing that final presentation. I just want to go home. I don't want to fucking hear about, I don't even care about um, fucking review for final exam. If I fail, I fail, whatever. At least get to get out of class and just not be there anymore. Uh, but it's, it's finally done with, I don't have to worry about it anymore. It's, just, it's, it's a pretty good feeling. Oh, cutscene. Shalele. Gosh, he's like that other guy in Bastok. Never leaves his post. It's there permanently forever. Like, does she need to go do stuff? Like, do other stuff that didn't just sit there forever? God, can you imagine, like, having, like, a life like that? Just, like, well, I'm stuck here forever. Well, I guess that's what, like, prison's for. And, like, being in a comatose state or being, like, in a fucking nursing home. But can you imagine just being, like, like she's, she's probably, like, 25 years old or something. 26. She looks like she'd be, like, 26 or something. Like... Should be doing other stuff. I'm even just sitting there forever. And I found out about this. Maybe about individual training. This is actually good for getting extra EXP. Because so he wants you to kill a certain amount of monsters. And if you do, good stuff will happen. Like, you get, like, extra EXP and you get, like, extra gill. And actually, I was walking around one day randomly with my, um, elven bitch. And... 
I ran across this group of people in the Guskin Mines. At first, you know, they were just like killing skeletons. I was just there killing skeletons on solo, and they were just killing the same thing I was killing. And it just like, you know, I knew at the time I couldn't party because it's a trial version. But then all of a sudden, I was invited to the party. I was invited, and then I got to actually fucking fight. I had to actually be in the party, and I learned about book burning, which is basically book burning is where like you know I just went to that book and I like actually that like mission thing right. Well, basically, you said to repeat in that in the Guskin Mines, you make a giant party, an alliance, which is more than six people, like three different three groups of of like you know more than like up to like 18 people or 12 people, I guess. And you just kill the same monster over and over, the skeleton, and just burn the book, basically. And just go for the book, repeat the mission over and over, and you gain tons and tons of EXP. So, like, in the course of, like, I don't know, a few hours, I got from, like, level 18 to 27. I was like, holy shit. And that took, like, you know how long it took me to get to 27 back in the day? About, probably about three or four years just because I didn't have time to play the game or I was like you know fucking I didn't have internet for like a whole year but what took you know, what has taken like you know about because I got to like level 34 when I quit but I got to level 27 like from 18 to 27 just like that so basically what took like you know ages upon ages of time only took like has only taken like a matter of like less than two weeks because the 14 day trial period hasn't ended yet. I think I still have another like. I might have not a week left. I don't know. I haven't kept track since I started it. Holy crap. That's insane. That's better. I like that. I like being able to see. So yeah, definitely getting a lot of levels. And that was nice. Like, the party system is very different, though. It's very much different from what it used to be. Well, it, it's different, but at the same time, it hasn't really changed much, which is good. Because if it changed too much, I wouldn't be like, ugh. But, you know, it's a basic concept, you know. You have, like, a camp somewhere. And somebody kites the monster, which means they attack the monster, and then run back to the camp where all the other party members are, and then all the party members just gangbang the monster until it's dead, or they're all dead themselves. Okay, good. Do I have any skills as a thief? Probably not. Perfect dodge. Okay, that's useful. Weapon skills, no. What to my job traits? Nothing so far. Awesome. Oh yeah, if you haven't noticed, I changed the music. As much as I like the nostalgic feeling of the old music, I decided to change it because something from Final Fantasy XIV because I'm never going to play that game, probably, but I want to at least hear the music from it and see how it fits into the game, so... Yeah, that's why the music's different now. Yeah. Alright, let's go kill this motherfucker. Let's go kill him. Get some fuck burn. Oh god, I'm slagging. Get some book burning stuff. Oh yeah! Spinach juice all over your face. One more attack. Come on, Mephra. Hit him. Come on, Phallus! Phallus! Hit him! Hit him! 
Hit him, fellas! So, yeah, yeah, do more damage next time. Kill him! Kill him! No! Not my dudes! Ah! Uh, ah! Uh, oh, I leveled up! Yes! Woo! Woo! What the fuck is that in my head? Fuck. And I got Wasp Sting! Yes! Oh, yeah, that was good. That was good. That was real good. Alright, let's go find another Mandragora. Test out the little Wasp Sting! Yes! Oh, he's... Is it worth it? Yeah, let's just try it. Let's see what happens. Poison start. Oh! Yes, poison that bitch. Ugh! Free- Wow! That was terrible. Free damage. I don't even think he's... Is he... Yep, he's poisoned. He's taking a little bit of damage. That's good. Yay, treasure chest! Oh, well, there might be something good in there. Apple juice. I think that's like HP regeneration, so let me use that. Oh, it's MP. Fucking fuck. Ugh. No, we're not fighting that thing. And like with the other two um, nations, there are different types of beast men that are in this area, other than the orc and the quadav. We will see them hopefully soon. We will definitely hopefully. There he is! There it is! The other beast man type, Yagudo. Yag Yagudo. I don't know. It's Yagudo. Yeah. My friend John used to call him Yagundos, and. There's a crazy story about them that we we have. Oh fuck, Christ! I just scared the shit out of me. That looks freaky. Those things are freaky as fuck. The crawlers, but they when they have like a special drop or like a certain item that they drop. I think it's like silk something. It's worth a lot in the auction house. I used to like just come here. I used to come to Winders just to like kill those crawlers and then sell the um silk that they dropped and get like a little bit of cash. It wasn't a lot, but to me, it was it was it was a fair amount of cash. It's always good to have a good amount of cash, you know. Just be like, all right, yeah, we got some money. Got some money, honey. It's kind of funny. I had sex with a Playboy bunny. No, not really. I wish. That'd be awesome. Your gundo. We're not gonna touch him, no, not yet. He cannot be touched. Not until I'm high enough, not until I'm big enough. Once I'm big enough in the level department, then I can touch him. I can touch him. Phallus can touch him. My phallus can touch him as much as it wants to. Yes. I named my character Phallus and it got through the sensors. I don't know how. I guess because they don't realize that. I don't know. I always thought Phallus would be like a good name for like a fucking monster. Like, you just name like this. Fucking monster. His name is Phallus. He seems like a good name. Pixie, heal me! Stop moving. Heal me, bitch. I'm at yellow. I'm at yellow health. Hey. Hey. Hey, you see me? I need healing. They should be resting. Oh, fuck you, you bitch! Fucking Pixie. He doesn't even fucking heal me. I'm at yellow health now. Is that a yellow? Yeah, it's yellow. Fucking posh twat. Thanks for nothing, fucking asshole. Alright, where's the tiny mandragora? I'm gonna rape them. With my dagger. Oh my god, fucking mouse. I need, a, I need to buy a new mouse. I have one, but it, it sucks. Like the, the mouse I bought is worse than the mouse I'm currently using, so I don't, I'm, I'm gonna sell it on eBay. But I need to buy another mouse. Much like the Frilla one I have right now, but... Just buy it new, so that's not all, like, fucking... Whenever I try clicking, it doesn't register, or... If I do click, it double-clicks, because sometimes... When I click on something, it'll just double-click for no reason, and then open some programs. Or... 
Where the Mandragora's at? No, not facing you. You're fucking too hard. No, very tough. Why did, why did very tough all of a sudden? That's fucked up. That's not cool. Ugh. It sucks being a level two thief. When Dursty and I should probably equip that. See, that sucks. Because you can't get the Windurst and Wing and Bastok or Sandari. You can only get in Windurst because it's a Windurst ring, which is pretty redundant of me to say, but yeah, it's true. And I don't like Windurst, so if I do actually start playing this game full time again, I'm not going to make a character at Windurst because I just don't like it. Like, no. Bastok is my home. Bastok is my stomping grounds and shit. That's where it's at. And I don't really like Sandaria because it's, it's too pristine and shit. So fuck Sandaria. Even though my character's an elven, I don't like really like Sandaria. Which is the, which is the home of the elvens, incidentally enough. Oh fuck. Where am I going? I haven't like fought a monster in like a while. I don't see any more tiny. Okay, stay away from you. Oh god, is he following me? Oh god, that thing's so freaky looking. Ugh. It's like one of those monsters, you look at it and you're just like, ew. That's fucking weird. I'm not even gonna try it. I'm not even gonna try it. I've already know what's hap- I've already tried it at least two times in the past and... We know what happens when you go near that fucking planar shift. Or planar rift. Nothing. Despite the fact that I'm butt-ass naked. Running around in tights and I'm a Mithra, it's not gonna elicit a response. It just isn't. Hey, hey, stop moving! Yeah. Ow. Alright, one more, and I'll get the, that mission right there completed. I mean, they give you like at least, they give you a lot of EXP, more than what you actually need. But it's a training ground, so, or, or ground, field, field training book thing, whatever. Yeah! Fucking headbutts. He, he fucking headbutts me and just falls right back on his ass. That's insanity. Yes! 270 experience points. 270 gil! And 27 tabs. The tabs are basically like points you use to buy certain abilities like healing or instant regeneration or. MP regeneration or whatever. Use it to buy stuff. That's the main point. Is there even anybody here? I just I, I should check that. No, I'm the only person here. That's cool. I'm all alone. The hell? How do I have MP now? Why do I have MP? Well, I can't really use magic unless I have a sub job. But I'm not gonna be able to get it done, get that on this character because it takes a long time to do. I got it on another character, but not on this one. Well, I just start. I just made this character. You don't get sub job until level 18.
me use a keyboard. Fuck the mouse. Yeah, we'll, we'll try fucking you in the face. I think it can take you. Oh god. Oh god. Yagundo. No! 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 Oh god! Holy shit, I'm so far! No! 